This is an audiovisual representation of a study published in the Journal of Bone and Joint Surgery in 2019. Ankle arthrodesis is the most commonly used procedure to treat end-stage ankle arthritis. However, total ankle arthroplasty, or TAA, is rapidly becoming an increasingly popular alternative. While both procedures can be performed by either an orthopedic surgeon or a podiatrist, these providers differ in their education and training. Hence, not much is known regarding the differences between these two surgeon types in terms of surgical outcomes and cost. A group of researchers from the Icon School of Medicine performed a study to investigate the differences in cost, opioid utilization, and other outcomes between these two types. They used a national claims database to review 3,674 and 4,980 cases of TAA and ankle arthrodesis procedures completed between 2011 and 2016. They found that 76.5% and 75.3% of the TAA and ankle arthrodesis procedures were performed by orthopedic surgeons, while 18.8% and 18.3% of the TAA and ankle arthrodesis procedures were performed by podiatrists. The proportion of procedures performed by podiatrists increased over the study period, and this was coupled with increased costs and longer hospital stays, but differences in opioid utilization remained non-significant. Podiatrists were found to treat sicker patients with more comorbidities and were more likely to perform surgeries at smaller, non-teaching hospitals. Thus, the study found the increased trend of procedures being performed by podiatrists was coupled with increased hospitalization and costs when compared to those performed by orthopedic surgeons. Given the growing demand for these procedures, factors associated with resource utilization such as the type of surgeon may need to be carefully considered on the population level.